subscribe and download over 1 million code snippet including this tutorial from codegive.com, link in the description below. Sure, I'd be happy to help you with that. Before we start, let me provide some context for those who might not be familiar with CUDF and Pandas. CUDF, CUDF is a GPU data frame library for loading, joining, aggregating, filtering, and otherwise manipulating data. It is part of the Rapid Suite, which is a collection of GPU accelerated data science libraries. CUDF provides a pandas like API, making it easy for users familiar with pandas to accelerate their workflows with GPUs. Pandas Pandas is a popular data manipulation and analysis library for Python. It provides data structures like data frame and series that are efficient and easy to use for various data analysis tasks. Now, let's proceed with the tutorial on installing CUDF and Pandas with the help of PIP. Ensure that you have a compatible GPU and the necessary dependencies, CUDA, etc., installed on your system to leverage GPU acceleration. Open your terminal or command prompt and execute the following command. This will install the CUDF library on your system. Next, install pandas. You can check if the installations were successful by launching a Python interpreter and importing CUDF and pandas. If you don't encounter any errors, then both CUDF and pandas are successfully installed. Now that you have CUDF and Pandas installed, you can seamlessly switch between the two libraries depending on your use case. CUDF is especially beneficial for large-scale data processing on GPUs. This example demonstrates how you can leverage CUDF for GPU-accelerated operations and then seamlessly convert the result to a Pandas data frame for further analysis. That's it. You've successfully installed CUDF and Pandas and learned how to use them together in a Python environment. Feel free to explore more advanced functionalities and adapt them to your specific data analysis tasks. ChatGPT